uh, offensive and defensive play that you saw from Jalen. Um, what were you thinking on that one play he had with the you know, offensive rebound and was able to uh, get that big score? And how much improvement does that show for him you know, in the game? Yeah, I mean, he, he really decided he was going to lock in and just do everything he could inside the paint. Second half, he just started rebounding everything and blocking shots. So, I mean, the one possession where he had the offensive rebound and then he had the he had the M one bucket. I mean, he was just playing really well in the paint. And, uh, you know, we kept giving him the ball early in the second half. He was drawing fouls. And, uh, you know, it showed that, you know, he was comfortable and he was ready to go. So we just kept giving it to him. For Jalen, I mean, considering the, the shifts in the front court that have happened lately, I mean, how vital is it for him to kind of carry that unit? Be that guy. Oh yeah, I mean it's very vital. I mean he's he's our he's one of the leaders on the team, especially for our big guys this year. So I mean for him to be comfortable out there, playing confident, grabbing rebounds, uh, playing tough in the post. I mean it's, it's a really big thing because he's setting the example for the guys that are coming in uh, to back him up to play the full. So I mean he, him and Dante both with that energy inside the paint, rebounding, posting up, setting hard screens, and being being tough uh, physically. I mean that's that's a really big big part of the game for us. CAG Federal brings a combination of military operational and commercial business experience to your organization. We mix extraordinary organizational management experience with strong leadership skills to provide your department with the best chance for success. When 99.9% .9 reliability isn't good enough, call CAG Federal at 877-797-8776 or on the web at cagfederal.com. What's different you for guard lineup? I mean spacing. I mean with four guards out there, you know, you, you get to space out, four guys around the perimeter. So when you drive the, the lane opens up a little bit, you know, you have the dump off the sticks. So I mean I mean spacing when it when it's a four guard lineup is completely different versus having the four and the five in like sticks and chill, they both gotta play around the rim. But I mean at the same time it's it's, it's just a matter of everybody being patient, and letting the offense come to us and uh, that, that showed a lot today. We were able to get inside the paint each individual and creep. You've been here for about a year and a half. We're even hiding ankle breakers until today. Hey, I can't even tell you where that came from. I was I was just trying to make a play, and I mean, you I saw I saw him start sliding, so I just decided to keep going. You mentioned that it seems like the. It just feels like the team is having more fun and enjoying yeah, it yeah. more. How much do you think that contributes contributes to you know controlling the ball and limiting turnovers? I mean, that's a huge contribution when everybody's out there having fun, playing comfortable, and you know not not worried about any consequences or making the wrong play. Everybody's just playing to win, and uh, when we're playing to win, when we're having fun, we're just playing comfortable and patient, and you know letting the game come to us. So. You guys, you guys are